experiencing problems with your 8BitDo Ultimate Controller's left stick or triggers? You're not alone. Many users encounter issues like dead zones, unregistered full movement, or triggers not registering maximum press. The most common problems include dead zones in the joystick center, joysticks not registering full movement range, and triggers that only register around 80% of maximum press. The primary solution for these issues is controller calibration. This process resets the controller's understanding of joystick and trigger ranges. Step one, enter calibration mode by pressing and holding LB plus RB plus minus plus plus for eight seconds until the status LED blinks. Step two, calibrate the joysticks by rotating them at their full edge two to three times. This teaches the controller the complete range of movement. Step three, calibrate the triggers by depressing them fully two to three times. This ensures the controller recognizes the complete trigger range. Step four, complete the calibration by pressing LB plus RB plus minus plus plus again. This saves the calibration settings to your controller. If calibration doesn't fully resolve your issues, the next section will cover rebinding options and firmware updates for optimal performance. If calibration doesn't resolve your controller issues, the 8BitDo Ultimate software provides powerful customization options to optimize your controller's performance. The software allows you to remap buttons, adjust stick and trigger sensitivity, and control vibration settings. You can create custom profiles for different games and situations. You can also adjust or disable the central dead zone of your joysticks directly on the controller. Press and hold the minus and plus buttons simultaneously for five seconds to toggle zero dead zone mode. Keeping your controller's firmware up to date is crucial for optimal performance and compatibility. Use the 8BitDo firmware updater to ensure you have the latest features and bug fixes. During firmware updates, ensure only one device is connected at a time, either the controller or the receiver, but not both. This prevents update conflicts and ensures a successful installation. Firmware updates are especially important for compatibility with newer gaming systems like the Nintendo Switch 2. Regular updates ensure your controller works seamlessly with the latest hardware. If you experience connectivity problems where the controller connects and disconnects repeatedly, update the firmware for both the dongle and the controller. This resolves most connection stability issues. If issues persist after trying these solutions, contact 8BitDo support directly at support at 8bit.com. Their technical team can provide additional assistance and troubleshooting guidance.